Welcome to PSLE Maths, a YouTube channel where you can find solutions to problem sums from past year question papers. Search using the school name and question number or the keywords in the question. Hello kids, let's look at a question from one of our subscribers. This question is from River Valley Primary School 2019 prelims paper. This is question number 16. The figure below is made up of three identical overlapping circles and one equilateral triangle. Given that the area of the triangle is 63 cm square and the radius of each circle is 7 cm, part A find the perimeter of the shaded part A, part B find the area of the shaded part B. Let's look at the shaded part A. It is in the shape of a crescent. So the perimeter of the crescent, either it goes by the part 2 or if it goes by the part 1 either ways the perimeter would be the same. So when going by the part 1 it is nothing but the circumference of a full circle. So for part A of the question it is nothing but circumference of the circle which is pi d pi here is 22 by 7 times d here diameter is 14 centimeters so the answer is 44 centimeters. That's the answer to part A of the question. Coming to part B of the question, the small shaded area is the part B. To find the area of this shaded part, we split the triangle into three parts and draw a hexagon around the triangle inscribed inside the circle. See, we notice that here part 1, 2, 3 together forms the area of the triangle. And part 1 is equal to part 4, part 2 equal to part 6 and part 3 is equal to part 5. So the whole area of this hexagon is 2 times the area of the triangle. Now let's find the area of the circle which is nothing but pi r square. Pi here is 22 by 7 times 7 times 7 which is 154 centimeter square. Now the area of the triangle times 2 because we have Two such areas inside that hexagon so area of two triangles is 2 times 63 centimeter square which is given is equal to 126 centimeter square now if we subtract the area of the hexagon from the area of the circle we get six small portions left out around the hexagon I have shaded one such section area of the circle minus the area of the Hexagon is 28 centimeters square. Now this 28 centimeters square is the six parts. So one part is 28 divided by 6, which is 4.66 centimeters square. In shaded part B, we have two such portions. So we multiply that by 2, so which is equal to 9.33 centimeters square or 9 1 by 3 centimeters square. So that's the answer to part B of the question. This question can be done easily using trigonometry in secondary school, but to do it in P6 level, it would be a tricky question. Hope you like this video. Please subscribe to this channel for more problem sums. If you have a specific question that you would like to see a video on, please post it in the comment section. Thank you.